Okay, we got the man, 12 yen sat daddy in the house. We got Locke. Locke with the biggest, I don't know how he smiles for this many hours, but he smiles the whole tournament. You can't stop him. What's with the cam? Uh, I don't know, actually. Tino, do you want to? This matchup is impossible, says Dr. Light. Another Samus set? Yep. Very interesting. David does not move. Oh, because the cameras are frozen. Yeah. That would explain a lot. The cameras are frozen, Michael. Oh. I love watching Samus. Yeah, I also enjoy watching Samus. Yeah. As well as my man Sat Daddy. Um, so what would you say Sat Daddy's strengths and weaknesses are as a player? Uh, what? <laughs> what, are Zach's, what are Zach's strengths as a player? Um, I don't know. He's kind of good at this game. Like, in a kind of like... But, okay, like what I like San is that Diego he does like. a lot of cool things. Mm, maybe. Sometimes. I don't know. Like, the cool things that he does are easy, though. So you're saying they're not cool at all? Well, like, the hard things that he does are not cool. And the cool things that he does are not hard. Yeah, that's I what see. I think. I see. Mm -hmm. uh, there's some parable about women here, I'm sure. And two women are playing uh, Super Smash Brothers Melee. Sheik, I, I prefer to think, just identifies as Sheik. Um, whereas Samus is extremely strong and powerful. Wait, what? And I think... So okay. Tino, Wait, what are you talking about? Would you date a girl that's like, that's taller than you? How first of all, how tall are you? I don't know, like five eight. Five eight. I feel like, like you're that. higher than that. I don't know. I know. You're still growing, so it's like, mm -hmm. it's just it's just changing a lot. Yeah. But would you date like a six a six foot tall girl? Or have you not really put on to it? I don't. I don't think so. I don't like it. I don't like the girl being taller than me. I see. Would you? Oh yeah, of course. No, I've dated, I've dated some like 6'3 women. I've dated women on the crew team. Are you just saying that because your girlfriend's like 6'3? Six, six, no, actually, she is shorter than me. Oh, uh, okay. She is, she is currently like a well, solid... She's a keeper, though. She's a 5'5". Five, five. She is a keeper. And you know why? Because she is just a great person. 
That's good. I, I don't really eat that much, and she brings me food. And she's very kind. Aww. And generally just a good person to talk to. And, you know, you're just looking for someone to hang out with, mostly. Mm -hmm. And I think if I were to go back, I would not have spent as much time in relationships with the people I didn't want to hang out with. Like, and it's not like, so you gotta, you gotta know, like, I mean, you don't, you gotta get to know them, right? Mm -hmm. That's what dating and relationships are, right? In some sense. But, I, I don't know, oh, it's a triple spot dodge. Samus' spot dodge, I'm legitimately convinced is broken. Really? Oh yeah, no. No? Not at all. Yeah, Michael honestly, I was openly sad. rooting for Michael to beat Locke so I could play Locke, because I feel like I've learned... I've learned some things about the matchup. I didn't want to play Locke, even yeah, I though I beat Locke last time I played him. Yeah, I don't but really. Know. Samus is not fun to play against. No, not really. I like think what? I figured out the matchup though. I think the bro the problem with Santi is that Santi encourages bad behavior, and by that I mean like he encourages all of us to just be like, yeah, it's totally okay that we just hate Samus, and we're not gonna think about how to beat them. Yeah. And we're just gonna be mad about like Samus. Um, I, I think Santi is really good, and he doesn't want other people to be as good as him. Santi's a bully. Huh? Yeah. I think Santi doesn't want melee to be ways that he doesn't want melee to be. Okay. Probably just to get me on the inside. <laughs> Michael just said, switch the headsets, give Jake the better headset. I thought this was a little better for the... Because we're talking to each other? I don't know. Um, yeah, this, this is kind of in the way. Oh, no. I'm disappointed in myself today. I got mad again. Well, you're still in though. Yeah, and now I get to play you again and try getting mad again. And yeah. we'll see We'll see if that works out. I, I remember that, like, the first game, you were not happy. No. And then the second game... I got won. a Gimp at zero, and mysteriously I'm happy yeah, again. Yeah, you're really happy. Yeah. Oh, God. All right, so back to back to the match. Oh, shoot. I can't... I can't I'm, see this. I'm actually screen. okay not seeing this match. Yeah, same. Can yeah. you just cover the whole Can you take the, the chat and just cover it the yeah. whole way? We'll just listen for the noises and, and pretty much just interpolate yeah. what we think's happening. I like the music. Yeah, I like the I music. I wish the sound effects weren't going on. Though. I agree. Man. So, do you think we should start up the Smash Families thing again? I think so. Well, I don't know. We're gonna have to, like, redo it. Oh, uh, yeah, I guess. Because everyone's gone. Yeah, that's, that's actually faces. a big thing. And, like, so many of our, our good players are so... I mean, they're they're always willing to mentor, but it's hard to get them to come to things and yeah, you know, go to a specific thing. I guess. I think it's just be like whoever you want to train. Doesn't have to be like randomly assigned. I think if you went to SSS, you could upset a ranked fox or a ranked like a bunch of other characters. You think so? Yeah. I like well, you look at the people who are getting these upsets, and you look at you, and you look at the things that you're good at, and and the things that like they're good at. And it's, you know, good punish game, calmness under pressure, that kind of thing, and it's... Yeah. I, d I don't see a reason why not. At all. One player I thought I could beat is uh, Jace. Oh, that's interesting. But, um... Because I really like the Falcon matchup, but... I like when to I played see him in tournament, he uh, played Falco against me. It was pretty close, but Did he? Oh, that's unfortunate, yeah. Because, yeah. like, here's the thing, like, secondary Falcos are actually hella hard to beat if yeah. they're, like, at all practiced. It's like, if they're not practiced... Then I don't really know. Well, I don't think like if you know how to do Falco stuff and you're ranked, yeah, like in SoCal, I think you're still gonna be pretty good. Yeah. Tino versus Akasumoto would be interesting. I think you guys would match up interesting on style. I don't think like he'd beat you or you'd beat him in like a particular style way. I just think it'd be interesting. I did take friendly off him, so I think I should be ranked in SoCal. Well, when he wasn't, like, when he was ranked in SoCal, I think I should have been ranked instead. Me, I, friendly off him. I see. That is how it works. That's yeah. how the PR does the does the data. Really. Mm -hmm. Alex 19 is friendly's monster. That's why he's up where he is. You know, it's a big part of it. I'd yeah. Say. Like um, he 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 beats Mango. He does beat Mango. Um, right now, me and Tino are just chilling and losers. There's been an incredible amount of Fox on Fox violence. Mm -hmm. um, no, actually, Mr. Green and Junior both went Falco. But they're still part of the Fox Squad. They are still part of the Fox Squad. And that's why I think we should add Meme Lord. I think Meme Lord would be an important part of the Fox Squad. I don't think so. I, I think we should. I think he's improving not, fast. Not he did not lose every game to my Game & Watch yesterday. But he's playing Falco. What? Yeah, yeah, it's like level 8 or something. There's like 5 what dragon What the fuck eights. is that shit? <laughs> they have 5 dragon no, well, they have like What's dragons. up, Aaron? Are you serious? Okay, that's that's actually a hundred percent fucking stupid. This is this is some Irvine ass gym. 
Ew, you can you could beat the fire dogs with the water dog. What's your favorite Pokemon, Tino? Maybe Raichu. Maybe Raichu. What a terrible choice. <laughs> Why? Tino, this choice is either take turn off the mics. Tino, that's terrible. That is a terrible Pokemon. Actually, no, I like Raichu because I don't really see why Raichu, why Pikachu can't be Raichu. I think that was a big mistake. He should have just gotten strong. What's you, your? Uh, it's my favorite. Pokemon? Probably Arcanine. Really? He's just a big giant dog. I don't know. He's having a good time. Yeah, I think he's pretty like a pretty cute Pokemon. He's a best Pokemon is Tropius 420 Blazer. What's your least favorite Pokemon? What's my least favorite Pokemon? I was gonna make a joke, but I decided not to. My great, my least favorite Pokemon has to be Samus. Oh yeah. That's actually not true. Mine's Ice Climbers though. Yeah, Tropius is a fucking dinosaur. Like fuck you. Great point, Surge. Um. Uh, Surge, uh, Michael has your bucket, which he is no doubt thrown up there. That's disgusting. I assume that's why he has the bucket. Least favorite Pokemon. Gee. It's actually really hard. Do you have a least favorite Pokemon? No. Okay. I was just asking, because I was thinking about making a joke, but I said not to. Oh, that's nice. Least favorite Pokemon has... I don't know, probably Pidgey. That's so lame. I don't know, because I always pick up a Pidgey and he's on that squad early and he puts in the hours and maybe I put him in the box after the 5th gym, but he's doing a good job and he's he's flying. Michael Tran has finally used a Lucky Egg in Pokemon Go. Yeah. Michael actually forfeited out of losers to uh, upgrade his Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is, is the set finally over? Okay, cool. Jake, let's play. <laughs> Where's my controller? Is this my controller? I don't know. <laughs>